What is going on? Look, you guys asked for it. I told you when I got on TikTok <laughs> that we were going to bring the TikTok community to NBA today. That's what we are. I'm leading this segment. Everybody's on the side because this is what we do. This is what we talk about. <laughs> oh, so God. we asked you guys to give us your hottest take for the season. And so we want to hear it. We want to hear. We want to hear from the community. So first up, what do we got? Who do we got? What's up, RJ? I think Herb Jones is a starter on the championship unit. He gives me Bruce Bowen vibes. I think he's going to be an all-league defender in the near future, and we're going to have a serious conversation about him being the defensive player of the year. Oh, Ooh, okay. Okay, see, that's a smoking hot take, too. When a lot of people are talking about the New Orleans Pelicans, it's not just Zion. It's not just CJ. It's not just all the Brandon Ingram. It's not that. They have a very complete team, including that rookie, Herb Jones. She has some issues with his with his name. Wait, but, no, I nah. think the name Herb is awesome. So we talk about that every time we mention his prowess on the defensive end. He is a bad, bad man, and I love it. That's a deep cut, and everybody, this is the OG. You guys asked me to get him on ESPN. He's on ESPN. All, All right. right. Who is next? Who's next? Who we got? Who we got? 76ers will be playing in the NBA Finals this year. Oh. Embiid is extra hungry after being snubbed last year. And let's be real, all the mojo in the world with the city of Philadelphia right now with the Eagles and Phillies dominating. Oh, Ooh. all what right. You, what you got? For uh, Anna. Anna? Uh... Did you see what happened in the last two games? I, I'm just saying the East is stacked. I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at Anna's take here. Uh, I think the Sixers are going to be interesting this year, but the Bucks, I think we kind of all agree, they're still in that upper echelon so, right now. So we brought Anna on NBA Today just for you to just, just you know. Actually, no, we brought her on. I saw on her TikTok yes. she went on a date, I yeah. think, a couple of How'd days the date ago. Go? So I hope that went well, Anna. I hope it, I hope it went well. We'll see your next take soon. Uh, okay, we'll see you next. And also, too, I, this is the last thing I want to say. Anna was the only basketball player that we found. Where are my high school basketball Hoover. players? Where's yes, Stanford at? Where's, oh, there's not. Where's Arizona at? Adia, get your people out there. I, listen, I, we need some more basketball people. Please. If you're not watching NBA today, don't tell me they're you know in basketball. They're studying if they're in Arizona. It's you know that. Yeah. Yeah. First of all, let's be honest. <laughs> like, let's be honest. All right, all right. I want to hear from more people. All right, who's up next? Who's, who we got? We got one. We got some more. We got some more. Who's up next? Speaking, and it's not because of Steph, it's not because of Clay, it's not because of Dre. It is because of this man right here, James Wiseman. Oh. Against other powerhouses in the West, like the Suns and the Grizzlies with dominant big men, we just couldn't keep up with our small ball. So now that we have James, I'm telling you, he's coming back to the Bay again. All right, Ooh. do you agree with Sloan? See, this Sloan is this whole new generation of Warriors fans. Yes. They're confident, yeah. they're cocky. They don't even remember the misery. James <laughs> Wiseman looks good. I got to give it to her. He looks good. The pick and roll with Jordan Poole is yep. looking good, and Devin Chen is looking good. But look, if they win, if they actually win again. We all know why. Steph Curry and then everything else after oh, that. Oh, that's true, but there, you got to give credit to the depth. The fact that no, Wiseman they're, they're, that whole Their kids group, are ready. Next they're next they're ready. Sloan. Their second unit is the best in the 100%. NBA. And between him and Jordan Poole, I don't know who's going to be the most productive. That's going to be a good uh, one. Oh. Jordan Poole. You think Jordan Poole's going to be more? I he, think by he, the end. He, ten and ten. He can do it in like 15 minutes. That's what but I'm saying. But if there's competition there, the, the dubs are winning. The dubs are women. The dubs are women. All right. We got one last one. Where's my guy right. Big Perk at? Oh, boy. Where's We got Big Perk? Oh, no. Oh, we're going to play the video first? Okay. Give me the video. What we got next? What oh, we got God. next? My hot take is that Kendrick Perkins can now pronounce this man's name five times fast. I know he put in the work <laughs> in the offseason. He's ready to perform. Oh, Also, boy. shout out Big Perk and RJ. This was all RJ's idea. Okay. <laughs> okay, so. Okay. All right. Perk, can you Perk. do it? Can you can do, do it? it? Oh, he didn't even can have his ear it? in. Uh, yeah. Let's yeah, see, five I, I, times. I took my earpiece out. Once I once I found out that RJ was pretty much this was his segment, oh, I didn't wow. want to listen to him, so I took my earpiece out. So I didn't really hear nothing. Okay, can you say can you say Can you say Moses Moody five times fast? That was a bet on TikTok. I, 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 Let's hear Moses it. Moody, Moses Moody, Moses Moody, Moses Moody, Moses Moody, yeah! Moses Moody, 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 Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.